when Dan Chase was an operative, he pissed off people, and they want to kill him. Oh. How we approach those scenes, we wanted them to feel real so that the stakes were real. Now that this old world is coming back to get him, he's forced to step into something that he's not quite sure he can do anymore. Good rehearsing, thing. Yeah, for sure. Good. OK, let's go again, gang. Action and stunts for motion picture, you're still telling a story. and it has to be performed right. And if it's not being performed right or making sense, then you're not telling a good story. Why not make the action, the fights, the car work all be a part of the story and make sense? We take the words off the page from the incredible writing on the show. We were able to take that and design some memorable action for it, whether it's cars, rigging, fights. I think what gets put on camera will feel real and raw and organic. It's not a stunt-heavy show. It's a character study, but when we do do stunts, we do them very, very well. Doing fight scenes, that's a lot of fun, you know. Throughout my career, I've been involved in quite a few fights. There you go. The older you get, it gets a little harder, man, as you can imagine. But there's some bad old dudes, too. Dan Chase is one of those guys. It's like riding a bike, you know, once you've got that stuff in you. And he's a fellow who's trained early in his life, so he's been well trained. That that great? <laughs> <laughs> like that? It looks good on you, though. <laughs> Better on me, though. Okay. What? What? Here we go. Camera set. Ready. And. Action! I'm Thomas DuPont, and I'm uh, double in Jeff Bridges. Possibly obvious, stating the fact that I look very similar to him. Um, and of course, I, I do action for a living, so it made sense that I, I jump in and uh, do his stunts whenever he needs me. He's worked with Jeff in the past and understands his intricacies so that when we are creating the choreography, he has an understanding if Jeff is going to have difficulty. Jeff does like to go through all the choreography so that he understands it, so he knows why his physicality is either labored or he's energized or whatever it is. It helps him, and Thomas is very integral in that. Anymore you send it, ma'am, send him back in bags. Everything is team. Great action is designed by a team, not one person. Everybody has a little bit of genius in the team, so if you pick the right team, bring the right people, you can create magic. We're all trying to make it an illusion that this is really happening, and so there's all little kind of tricks and stuff that you do to make that illusion successful. But the action on the old man is real, and that propels the story forward. Dan Chase has been out of the game for quite a long time. He might not physically be able to do everything he wants to do, but his passion, his fight, the drive within him, he will stop at nothing to face whatever comes at him.